What's going on guys and girls? Welcome back to Riding Along with Dan. It is uh, 1.36 in the afternoon, 88 degrees outside. I'm on my way back from uh, getting my two new front tires. Uh, I got there right away. I mean, when I got there right away, they uh, started working on it and took the tires off. And you know, I had to take all my uh, my chrome stuff off, my lug nut covers and all that kind of stuff. So while they were doing the tires, we mounted the new tires on the rims. I took the opportunity to clean the lug nut covers and uh, clean all the chrome. This way, when I put it back on, it's you know nice and clean. So I'm on my way back to the yard right now. A little bit of traffic on the highway on Route 4. But uh, it wasn't that bad, no big deal. You know, you expect it around this time of day, you know. second load I jumped in there real quick cleaned it out this way it's nice and clean ready to go for tomorrow plus tomorrow I think it's supposed to rain so I'm glad I got it done today usually I try and do it which I think everybody should do I do it Monday Wednesday and Friday so I try and keep up on it because if you let it go to uh, clean it out. So I'm trying to keep up on it so it's not wedged in there like like solid, like solid rock and then it's a pain in the butt. Try and do it every second day, especially when you do front loader. I know that the garbage truck drivers have to do it too, but me personally, at least three times a week. It's got to be done. Because there's a mechanic's got to get in there to change your hose. He's not cleaning that shit out. So uh, you got to keep up on it, you know. So I had to do it today because we're really starting to stink. Really no 
truck for him because, you know, everything was in transition with taking over Bealey and what have you. So I used to end up doing about 150, 160 stops. And, you know, I had a hustle, man. It was a hustle. Because, you know, it wasn't one stop after the other. The stops were pretty much spread out. So it was, it was long days in the beginning, it really was, until uh, they started getting some more front loader trucks. And uh, when that happened, uh, I was asked at the time uh, what side or what route I would like to do. Because I, I did all the route. I did all the stops. I did New Milford. I did Oradale. I did Cresskill. I did everything back then. It was all on me. But uh, I decided to take the route that I do now. I wanted that end of the route, so I, I took that end. But, you know, I hate to hear guys crying about doing a little extra stop, uh, you know, because it's stupid, really. I used to come out here and knock this shit out every day. 150, 140 stops and not complain. So it was good. I'm glad IWS took over. It's a, it's a better company, a bigger company. And they sure do offer you a lot more. I didn't expect I would be driving uh, a brand new Peterbilt, but I did have my Mac for 10 years. And, you know, it really was starting to get a lot of problems with the regen. They just decided to say, you know what, let's just get rid of it, let's put them in a new truck, and that's it. So, it worked out good, it worked out good for me. I like the Peterbilt, it's a good truck. Like I said in the beginning, the only thing, the only difference is between this and the Mac, the Mac for me, had a little bit more leg room, and that's it. That's my only difference. Even in this town right here, Oradell, uh, I used to have a lot of stops in this town.
This right here, the left side and the right side is a country club where these boys, these guys play their golf. So you gotta stop and let them cross when you see them.
how it means, 85 degrees. I got the AC on, but I got the driver's window open. I know it's kind of weird, but I can't drive with the windows closed. I, I need fresh air. I don't know what it is, but I've always been that way. Gotta have fresh air. The strobe lights look good on my pickup truck. My mechanic uh, really did a great job, man. He hooked them up real nice for me. Nice, neat job with the wiring. Very good.
Oh, I'm sorry, man. I didn't see you come. Twenty six six four twenty six.
Yeah, hang out where? Hang out by the screen women. Wow, you're fucked up, man. <laughs> That's fucked up. No, you up. really go all the way over there? Wow. That's right. right. What? I always have a good day. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm going to sign off. I'm going to back up and park. And uh, I will touch base with you guys tomorrow. Be safe. Be good. And be careful. Later, guys.